All right, in depth now, and this week is National Stop on Red Week. Obviously, a very important thing to remember any day, but uh, even more so as we get closer to the first day of school, there's going to be a lot of extra traffic, a lot of school buses, which also have the red lights. You'll want to make sure you pay attention to those. So, to talk about this today is Amanda Day with Bike Walk Central Florida. Good to have you in, as always. Thanks Thank for you. stopping by. Glad a very, to be here. And very important topic, as we said, but um, right before the segment started, you were saying that uh, it's it's a shame that we have to have a full week to remind people to stop on red. It really is. And you think about it, though, is that we're out there reminding drivers to stop at stop signs and stop at red lights. And that should just be commonplace. But what is happening, actually, is that people aren't stopping. And about 22, almost 25 percent of the accidents out there are caused by people failing to stop, running red lights. So this is really just a full week of really driving awareness mm -hmm. of the issue and the solution. And stop. It's the uh, it's the distracted driving, the cell phones, the, the, the talking on the phones, texting, and even though you can't text and drive here in Florida. Yes, yes. I mean, that's kind of one of the causes of it, that people are distracted. Also, too, that we're just kind of stressed and sometimes even angry mm -hmm. um, when we're driving because we're always feeling late. And so all of that kind of contributes to this hurried feeling and attitude. And, you know, you're not aware that, guess what, there is a stop sign or you're supposed to stop at a red light. And this is also equally as important for the people on the bikes and people right. walking because, you know, the, the don't walk signs are there for us if we're walking, so we don't want to just dart right into traffic either, right? Well, no, exactly. And there's something to remember, too, about biking, right? That bikers need to follow the exact same laws as drivers. So they, too, are responsible and need to stop at stop signs or at red lights. And for people that are walking and crossing the street, the sign is there to tell you whether to walk or not to walk. They're at the signalized intersections, too. So it's almost like the signs will, follow, will allow you to follow a roadmap, if you will, of yeah. what you need to do. We were um, we were looking recently at a AAA study released about um, red light cameras. Obviously, right. those are those are always coming into question. <laughs> are they fair to have? Uh, AAA showed a 59 percent of Americans uh, support the use of those uh, red light cameras in urban areas. Mm -hmm. What are your mm -hmm. uh, What are your thoughts on that? Yes, uh, Bike Walk Central Florida supports red light cameras. Um, anything that we as a community can do mm -hmm. to enforce the laws, but also um, really remind drivers and walkers too, there are pen there's penalties out there. And if you don't stop, you're looking at, in Florida, about a $158 ticket. If you just joined us, we are talking with uh, Amanda Day with Bike Walk Central Florida about what is called National Stop on Red Week. And there is a local effort taking place on Friday. Um, tell me a little bit about that. It is. Actually, it's with the Florida Department of Transportation, Orange County. Um, Mayor Jacobs has a program called Walk, Ride, Thrive. Mm -hmm. So it's with them, enforcement agencies, as well as Bike Walk Central Florida. And we're going to be on the corner of Pine Hills and Silver Star Road, which is one of a higher crash corridor area. That was what I was going to ask you. Why the why Pine Hills Road? Yeah, it, it's, it's one of the areas, and especially that intersection, that has a higher incident of, of traffic crashes all the way around. Plus, with Evans High School, school um, is right there in the corner too and with school starting so yeah. there's an expectation of course there'll be more kids walking biking and driving so that is why we'll be out there Friday waving signs handing out you know tip cards and on the street corners too of just this is the law and it's important for people to obey it and we were talking earlier uh, briefly about uh, you know the fact that school does start August 13th in Orange County um, so the school buses are going to be out there and those have the red lights on them Exactly. That's equally as important. It is. It is equally as important. And so, once again, if you're following behind a bus that and the red lights come on and there is the stop sign, you need to stop too. So, come Monday, quite frankly, that um, drivers are going to wake up to a whole new reality again yeah. of there's going to be more traffic and there's also going to be a lot more school buses. And it is that awareness that's needed. So, that's why this Friday we're going to be out there. Reminding drivers to stop and pay attention. And let's face it, I mean, most people know that red lights mean stop. Yes. Most people know that stop signs mean stop. But when you're in a rush and you're 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 doing other things, you're 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 in a mindset of I got to get to work, I have to get here, there, and everywhere. It's a good reminder. 
Well, it's a good you know. reminder, but also what studies show too is that a lot of these messages about stopping on red, you always think, oh, it's that person next to me that doesn't do it. I'm right. the best driver, mm -hmm. right? And yeah. I mean, we're all shaking our heads, so yes, because we do. It's always their fault. It's right. them we're talking it's to. It's always the other driver. Now but look in the mirror because we've exactly. all done it before, and that is really the purpose of this message too is yes. Everyone needs to stop on red. That is a no-brainer. However, you need to pay attention and look out for each other and, you know, slow down. Good reminder. Amanda Day with Walk, Bike, Bike, Walk. <laughs> bike, bike, Walk, bike Central, walk Central Florida. Florida. Bike, Walk, let's all say it together. Bike, <laughs> bike walk, walk, Central Florida. Thanks for coming in. <laughs> Thank a very you so important much. topic, which, uh, which we hope it will uh, serve as a reminder. Thank you. Thank Good you for having you. us. Thank you.